It's really a lot of uh, a lot of fun to uh, to visit. We're talking about Estonia, uh, so um, yeah. Let me just tell you a little bit about Estonia. As you can see over here, it's a country of 1.3 million people, but still ranked in the top 15 globally, number 13 in the world, uh, the first in many regions. First of all, Eastern Europe, although uh, it's the Baltic region, they're also first in the Baltic. They ranked very, very high in the Nordic uh, region as well. So absolutely great performance from this country. Once again, so inspiring, only one, less than 2 million people and still uh, absolutely great performance and um, very good branding for this ecosystem. Uh, as for uh, verticals, look at this. There, there are some very interesting verticals over here. Uh, transportation, fintech, marketing and sales, all of them in the top 10. Super strong ecosystem. Uh, that's the map of the uh, the sample map of the Estonian startup ecosystem. Of course, those are not all the startups. It's only about ten or twenty percent, but still, uh, such a good quantity in such a small country. Uh, Estonia has uh, two countries in two cities in the rankings. The first one is Tallinn. Tallinn has managed to keep its position at number sixty six globally, uh, considering this has been a year where many Asian startup ecosystems have jumped. is actually absolutely a great achievement. Uh, and it's also ranked first in the Baltics and in other regions as well. Uh, Tartu in Estonia is second ecosystem and really brings a little bit of a backup for Tallinn, so that's very important. So good stuff from Estonia. And uh, Josh, let me uh, pass it to you. Thank you, Ali. So to discuss the Estonian startup ecosystem in more detail, uh, we have Anika from Startup Estonia. Hi. Hi, and thank you for this uh, super nice introduction. I'm very happy to be uh, part of this uh, discussion today, and I'm super excited to present to you uh, what the Startup Estonia and, uh, uh, has been doing and what's the Estonia Startup Ecosystem currently. I'll quickly share my screen, hope you see it. Um, so yes, Estonia is really the land of unicorns. Um, so uh, I'm working at the Startup Estonia as a Startup Peace and Foreign Relations Project Lead. Startup Estonia is a governmental initiative uh, and its aim is to boost the Estonian startup ecosystem. Um, so that's what we are dealing with and just quickly showing uh, the Estonian startup scene in numbers. Um, so the startup sector it keeps growing and um, it has grown approximately 30% per year. And as of today, we have 1,175 startups. Estonia is a very small country. We have only 1.3 million inhabitants. So these numbers are really great compared to the population. Um, yes, we have created a lot of uh, jobs in this uh, sector. Uh, we can even say that every 89th person works uh, in, uh, is somehow uh, related to Estonian uh, startup uh, workforce or is connected with startups. And um, uh, yes, recently, uh, last year, they paid taxes uh, 97 million and um, turnover was um, 70, 782 million euros. And overall, they have raised 1.8 billion uh, euros uh, uh, in the last 12 years. Uh, a lot of investments come from abroad. So this shows that the interest towards Estonia is very big indeed. Um, yes, so uh, on to the next. Um, one of the reasons why we think that the Estonian startups are so successful, um, one of the reasons is that we have a lot of unicorns. Um, we actually have seven unicorns in Estonia, and we are actually in the global top uh, for unicorns per capita in the world. Uh, in Europe, we are number one, but the, uh, in the rest of the world, uh, unicorns per capita Israel has more but we try to catch up very soon so a lot of su successful startups really and they give birth to uh, other successful startups so uh, for example one of the founders of WISE uh, was also the first employees in Skype so we can see that the, the knowledge passes on and uh, uh, that has uh, been one of the secret probably uh, of the uh, successful ecosystem. 
but then another thing why we think that the Estonian startups are so successful is that we have a lot of uh, support organizations. Approximately 150 uh, organizations are trying to support the uh, Estonian startup ecosystem. Uh, you can definitely go and check out uh, this information uh, at startupestonia.ee slash startup ecosystem if you want to, to learn more. But uh, yes, there are um, a lot of organizations that are pay are divided based on the sector that the startup is at, uh, at but as well as um, you know the phase that it is in. So you can find a lot of uh, mentoring events, uh, uh, organizations that deal with that, or you know incubators and accelerators, as well as um, funding and uh, everything related to that. So that's really great. Um, and if you want to access the uh, amazing ecosystem, then you can actually uh, use the Estonian Startup uh, Visa. Uh, it's uh, basically a program that is meant for uh, foreign founders who wish to relocate their startups to Estonia, as well as the Estonian startups who uh, wish to hire talent from elsewhere. So if you would want to be part of the Estonian Startup ecosystem, then that's a great tool uh, for you. Well, together already, already to over 2,800 people have relocated to Estonia and uh, they have come from all over the world, from Russia, around Turkey and India, for example. Uh, and it gives you the ease of access to the rest of the European markets, uh, of course, as well as to, you know, the access to Estonia. So uh, uh, Estonian market itself is definitely too small for your startups, but uh, in order to be part of the amazing Estonian startup ecosystem, then uh, that's definitely something that you can look out for. And through Startup Estonia, you can uh, access actually the highest level government officials, as well as uh, C-level business people and uh, VCs, of course, as well. Um, uh, yes, it's Estonia. That's probably the good side of being so small is that you can get actually into the table and have a cup of coffee with, uh, you know, another successful founder of a unicorn, for example. And then definitely check out the Estonian Startup Database. There you can find uh, it's the most extensive overview uh, of the Estonian Startup sector. You can go on and uh, get more insight of the startups if, uh, uh, if you want more information in, regarding that. And make sure to follow us at, uh, uh, on all the social media channels. Uh, StartupEstonia.ee is our website. And if you have any specific questions, I will be happy to take them uh, uh, my email is listed here. Uh, so thank you very much. And it's been a pleasure to uh, be part of this uh, fantastic group of people today. Thank you. Thank you, Annika. And congrats once again on the success of your ecosystem. Good stuff. Uh, good. And um, now we have a question. Is there anyone else left to pitch? We're not sure about this. If there is and we forgot someone, please raise your hands on the Zoom chat and 